And we're not even sure that the Democrats are going to show up. And I've heard that uh, uh, one of the bills uh, has scores of pet projects for lawmakers of both sides of the aisle, which is traditional Washington. I heard from somebody at the White House yesterday that they think that there, there is a proposal from some Democrats to actually put foreign funding to foreign governments into this bill, uh, while at the some, same time no money to uh, protect our and that, and that could be central in South America because uh, the Guatemala, Ecuador, uh, uh, El Salvador, these are where these people are coming from, uh, some with bad intentions, some with not intentions. Some are desperate and some are just being promised a rose garden when the one doesn't exist. And the question is, too, if you're coming to Washington to see the Smithsonian, 19th Smithsonian museums are closing. If you go to the National Zoo, no reason to wake the hippos or the tigers because you can't get into there. I was in St. Augustine over the weekend. Uh, or a few days ago, and I went to go to that uh, ancient first settlement in America, shut down, no one was allowed in, and a lot of people planned their vacations around that. So already people are being inconvenienced, and you wonder if they're going to ramp up the pain and if that will uh, improve the process for a negotiation. It but, is an inconvenience, yes, but the president is saying most of the people are good people, but there are some bad apples in the group, and even though it is an inconvenience, he's saying that your safety and your security as an American, he said right. you deserve to be able to go to sleep at night and not have to worry about being killed by an illegal immigrant. And we've seen that happen. We've seen there's so many um, moms and dads that we've interviewed that say, yes, it's very rare that this is going to happen, but it can happen and it happened to my child. And the president is saying, I want mm-hmm. to prevent other families from going through the loss. How about a police, got this officer? police officer in California? Yeah, it was just he suspected this guy, a, a driver of um, driving Ill- um, intoxicated. So right. he pulls him over and the guy pulls out a gun and shoots him and there's the there's the police officer yeah, Ronald Singh. Singh he shot uh, at a routine traffic a stop um, the person who is uh, accused of murdering him is Gustavo Arigia 33 he's being held without bail he will be arraigned later today he uh, the suspect is a known criminal alien and he is a gang member and after the shooting he led officers on a days long uh, manhunt apparently eight people now are in jail uh, regarding this, he is charged with murder. Seven others are charged with actually trying to help him while he was on the run. All right, so this, uh, Sheriff Adam Christensen did an op-ed. Uh, he 